Hey guys, Alex the Chiropractor here, and today we're going to talk about how to cook eggs with a steel pan, all right, the old-fashioned way. You don't have to worry about any Teflon, any kind of non-stick coatings coming off and, and contaminating your food. Uh, we're going to do it with butter and a steel pan. Now, come right over here. Um, I put the heat about on medium. That's a good place to start, and it's going to take just a couple of minutes to heat up here. All right, so now it's gotten up to temperature. I don't know if you can see it right now, but... No, I'll give it another sec. Okay, see, so you can see that you can see it dancing. All the, red, the drops are moving. All right, so we take a good chunk of grass-fed butter here. This is the good stuff. Fights inflammation. You want a good chunk, all right? All right, whoa, accident. All right, put it on there. And you know, sometimes you might get it a little bit too hot, which you just deal with, the butter will burn a little bit, no big deal. All right, so this is perfect right here. And I got a couple of eggs, boom. So you hear that sound? That's the sound of moisture. It's boiling and it's keeping the eggs off of the steel pan, it's preventing it from sticking. The heat is preventing it from, from becoming stuck. And this is exactly what you want. And you start peeling it back, spread it around, find out where it, you know where it's developed a little crust, spread the rest of the eggs around. I'm going to let it set here for a second, get really rigid, and then I'm going to flip it. First, I'm going to put a little salt right there, a little pepper, good. All right, we're getting there. All right, here we go, right there, boom. A little bit of a retarded flip, because I'm holding the camera with one hand. All right, get that back, yeah, right there, cool. Oh. All right. Now I got a little bit of cheese here too. You can put whatever you want. You can put a little bit of ham, a little cheese. Give that a second just to heat up a little bit on the bottom. It'll start moving freely once it's cooked. All right, so let me go like this. All right, flip it right over. Boom, perfect, perfect omelet. That's it, guys. If this was helpful for you, like and subscribe so I can bring you more, and I'll see you in the next video.